27-year-old Jonathan Leon Guerrero remains in stable condition at GMH after being bitten by a four-foot-long black-tipped shark yesterday afternoon off Ritidian Point. Leon Guerrero says he was spearfishing with family and friends outside the reef. His brother and three of his friends shot the shark, and he then hauled the shark in by jabbing his spear through its gill. However, Leon Guerrero says when he got inside the reef, the strong current made him lose his grip. The shark bit him and swam away. I was trying to look for the shark when I was getting up, and all of a sudden it came and it bit my arm, and then, then like it latched on like a bit. And so I held the, the shark's head, and um, I was just freaking out because I got bit by a shark. And so right there, um, I, held his, I held it, and then um, right when I felt it release, I let go and I pulled my arm out at the same time, and then it swam away. After he got bit, Leon Guerrero says he swam as fast as he could toward the shore while yelling for help. His brother and friends walked him in, and Leon Guerrero says someone on the shore called 911 for help. He adds while they were trying to stop the bleeding, his friends drove him up the hill to meet with the ambulance. Friend drove up the hill, retreated, and we met the ambulance halfway. And I was, just, I was feeling like really messed up, like I lost a lot of blood. I felt like I was going to die. Mm -hmm. That was crazy, dude. He also says the attack happened so fast that all he could remember was that a chunk of his forearm was bit off and that the pain hadn't kicked in yet. I didn't feel that much pain. I think my... My eyes like, were freaking out more than the, the, the way it looked and the pain. Leon Guerrero underwent surgery for possible nerve damage last night. Doctors were able to stitch his wound, but for the most part, Leon Guerrero says he's just happy to have survived. I feel kind of fortunate. I felt like I was going to die. Um, I'm fortunate that I still can move my fingers. Um, I'm glad I still have my arm. I'm glad I'm still alive. <laughs> Stuff like that. Just all the small things that count. He says that his brother and him try to go fishing at least twice a week. And although he was bit by a shark just yesterday afternoon, Leon Guerrero says it's not going to stop him from going out again. Nick Delgado, PNC News.